Never mind. Ace, you coming up, dude? What's going on? Pretty sure your plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry. Harry. So Ace has a bad limp that came out of nowhere the other day. You guys heard him on screen, I think. He kind of yelped. Um, and since then, I can't figure out what's wrong. Um, I thought it was... It looks like it could be ant bites on his toes. But I'm like, how did he get that here when we were streaming? Like, there ain't no bugs yeah. in here. Not like that. It is. And now it's where we become brothers. Oh boy. So anyway, so yeah, I'm just keeping an eye on him, but still kind of limping his his paw. I put some ice on earlier. Put some newest corn too, or like a you know some cream to help out, I guess. Join us. Oh. Everything we've been through. Did you forget about Flash kicking our asses for four years? We were we then. But we had each other. We're done. And I just realized in all my button mashing, I hit the mute button. <laughs> Did you get you guys didn't hear me at all? Uh, okay, that's cool. <laughs> I was mainly going, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh boy. Oh, nice. I figured we were gonna get another round in anyway. So here we go. Why do you keep fighting? Ow. You're not giving me a choice. It's true. You're not. Oh whoa. Ah, oh, got him. That hurts. Oh, great. Stay calm. Take him out one at a time. Is that what we gotta do? Get free Harry with more anti venom. No, that's I wanted you to hit venom with that, but that's okay. He's, he is a gnarly looking venom. Oof. There we go. Now or never. Nice. Good. We got his armor down. Oof. Do it. Charge him up. All right. We know oh, what dang it, I missed him. For everyone. <laughs> we gave you 
everything you ever wanted. Not true. I mean, you gave me some cool stuff. I'll be honest with you. You gave my friend back. No one got replaced, dude. Come on. That's not you talking. No! He saved me! Just like I'll save you! There we go. Got him? Let's get out of here. Look at this place. Work for Oscorp. What's that? Oh, what? Has that been here the whole time? It's gonna recharge, right? I hope so. Yeah, you are. Oh wait, his his thing came back. His his armor. Dang it. That sucks. Free Harry with more anti venom. There we go. We need that machine to recharge. There we go. Nice. Boom, got him. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Separate the thing. Ah, dang it. Come on, come on. Almost there. Oh. Good. Oh my goodness. That can't be it though, right? There's got to be video game logic. Usually means uh, three rounds. Although we did have four rounds with Scream earlier. Dude, look at this. As if he wasn't big enough. Oh, right in the eye. Rip his tongue out. Doesn't matter what you do to me. I'm never gonna heal the world with you. Huh. Dude, yeah, you're killing the world. Yeah, the meteorite. Sure did, dummy. Wait. What? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They actually did the wings? Oh, boy. <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, shout out to Donnie Cates. Uh, I think a lot of the him and Ryan Stegman. I hope they get a special thanks credit because there's spirals in this. There's, you know, which references Null and the Hive Mind and the Wings now. Um, Dan Slot with the Antivenom. I hope he gets a special thanks. Obviously, Stan Lee, Jack Kirby, Steve Jitko, um, Bendis also for uh, Miles. You hearing that? So, oh boy, <laughs> dude. Oh, and the wings are gone. Okay, so they just showed up to do that one thing, get him here, and that's it. Like he didn't have a million other ways he could have got here. <laughs> oh, the particle accelerator. So we're back here at the, the building we destroyed earlier. And we gotta fight him as Miles now without the anti-venom. Oh boy. I guess the electricity... Oh, we have the anti-electricity, right? Because of Lee. Yeah, no, I, I was super focused, uh, but I didn't mean to hit the mute button. <laughs> so, <laughs> I think I was just like... Frustration. I was like, ah, dang it, because I also hit the uh, 
the the button that brings up the menu that uh, that shows my broadcast. And so I was like, oh, so I think when I went to hit that off, I I hit the the mute on accident. Oh, there we go. Oh, and he's got the... Okay, so he's got the wings in this battle. That's cool. There you go. Save him. That's what you're... That's... You're good, kid. Actually save Harry. Trying. It's like, do this to dodge this. I'm like, yeah, dude, I'm trying. Oh, nice. Oh no! Boom! Good night, dude. Or at least for round one. <laughs> wow, we actually held our own there. Remember in the comics, Venom killed Miles' uh, mother, actually. Oh, dude. Is she gonna destroy it? Uh, oh, no, 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 no! He has us now. Wait, 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 oh. What is happening? Oh, he's... Oh, great. He's charging it up. Go, Miles, go! There you go! Tommy's not holding the, the meteorite, though. Great, here we go, another round. So we have gone four rounds with him. You're not doing this for Pete. You're doing this for yourself. You're holding Pete back. Boom. You took him away from us. No, we didn't, dude. You were sick. What the hell are you talking about? You were sick, man. He was worried about you. He kept your stations going. We remember what you did. Harry, man, that's the symbiote talking, not you. You were jealous. Ooh. That's why you pushed us apart. Maybe I was. Yeah, dude. You think you're better than us, don't you? I mean, I'm surprised I'm holding my own against you. Yeah, I thought we did too. Ow. How? Need to get up to him. Going right now. we go. Get him, Miles. Ooh, dude. Here's some good fights, though. I gotta say. Oh. Dang it. We gave you our chance. And I told you to shove it. Come on, Miles. Oh. Oh. Awesome. Oh, that's awesome. Dude, look at him. Look at what you're doing, dude. You're going to kill your friends. Come 
Come on, bring him back down. Oh no, we're we're just going with him. Jeez. Oh no. Miles, do not land on your head. Go, 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 go. We are your friend. No, you aren't, and you're not Norman's son either, dude. There you go. There you go. Don't kill him. Save him. No. Leave him alone. What's up, Kaiser? Yeah, I've actually learned how to parry <laughs> thanks to you. <laughs> I gave you a shout out yesterday. I was parrying left and right. Oh, good. Miles is. Oh, yes. Alley oop. Oh, crap. Kick him. Yeah. Go. Dude. God dang. This mission is called Punch Your Friend in the Face Numerous Times. Go, go. Oh, MJ holding the line. There you go. Do it, Miles. Should you guys be that close to a part of the accelerator when it goes off? Sorry for watching saying that, but you know what I mean. Oh, did he just rip the tongue? Oh, are they going to end up in a church? That'd be... Well, they're in front of the church. Dude, look at Peter. He's... No, you're not, man. We're not going to kill you. No. Kaiser said he's glad he, he taught me. He uh, took him a while to get a hang of it. Yeah, the timing was always a thing for me, too. But sometimes, I'll be honest, sometimes I it's like dodging. I nail it. I hit the timing perfectly. And I don't know. There was some kind of a update today. Uh, so I think that might have helped a couple things. Because I would glitch die, too. Like, it was it was weird. I'd glitch out of, off the map. Like, we had a couple weird instances. Oh, wow. Look at that. I'm glad they just told us to hold that down. I, if I had to time it, like, or do it perfectly, I would have messed it up. Come on, man. I'm done. No, you're not. Either way, Pete. We still have time? No, we don't. It'll kill them. And then it'll kill you. Oh, Help us save them. Shoot his arm, MJ. There you go. Sh can we shut the door on that? I guess we can't, because he he pried it open. Yeah, that didn't work last time. Oh! Oh, yeah, I was going to say, shouldn't that thing have a mind of its own, too? Oh. Come on, come on. Oh, no, 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 no. He wants us to kill him. Come on. Dude. Is this going to kill all of us? No! They make you choose? I mean... That was an instinct. I, I, it was an instinct. I, 
I would have liked to not press it. It probably just would have ended the match, though, or ended the... been like, restart. Where it might have been one of those decisions that goes all day, <laughs> where you can't not do it. Come on, tell me he's... You know what's interesting about that too, from a Harry as a Harry Osborn fan, is that's kind of Harry's journey too, in a way. Like even though in the comics and the, you know the Tom, uh, Tom, <laughs> uh, the Sam Raimi movies, um, he he has a moment of goodness right before he dies, and that's kind of what happens in um, the comics too, when he died in Spectacular Spider-Man 200. He had, like, a little glimmer of goodness. Oh, there goes the symbiote, huh? I mean, we know there's a red one still out there. But, uh, yeah. And Peter clearly has a white one. Come on, man. Please still be breathing. I'm sorry. No way, he actually... I'm sorry. He killed him, he didn't save him. God. Do it. Restart his heart, Miles, come on. Give me some room. Do it, do it, do it. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I gotta try. Yeah, stop talking and try. Oh boy. Come on. Did you see that hurt? Try again. Holy crap. Wait. <laughs> Peter wouldn't have survived if Harry died at his hands. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So is Norman still going to work on that serum? Harry. Pulse is weak. We got to move. Hopefully destroying that... that okay. stone and everything. Whoa, what, what are you talking about? What have you done to him? I'm so sorry. I'm coming with you, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I th we saved him. Miles saved him. Oh, boy. I think what Harry said to Norman earlier was right. Like, I'm finally strong and powerful. Be, but his chances of coming back are very slim. No. He's in a coma? Just keep him alive. Dude, it's... It's like all over again. It's looped. Like he's going to go back into some chamber, some science experiment for his dad. Dude. Yeah, right, Kaiser? Back in the jar.
Dude. Yeah, this Norman, I mean, I mean, not that he's completely innocent. He did, he was part of the Martin Lee thing and and the Ock thing, kind of, the devil's breath, but. Get the G serum ready. Yep. ASAP. Yep. He's going to, he's going to be forced to use it on Harry. Either that or he's going to test it on himself first and. And then use it on Harry. For the last but, few years, wow. tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. Either way, we're getting goblins in the but next we game. Kept going. We battled sickness, evil, cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. The city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but what is normal? Uh, no well, exists. Spider, being spider people is normal. Yeah, this Over the this whole city hour, got I've talked messed about how up. These events have changed me. Oh, she's a vlogger now. What up? What about Venom vlog? <laughs> In this ongoing series, I was oh, she's doing a podcast throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I oh, hope she you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. Hey, New Normal. I like that because it's NN, like Venom Vlog. I'm all for alliteration. <laughs> the New Normal. Nice. Oh, don't worry. You'll see that uploaded on my channel. Nice. I was. I wish I had the camera on. I didn't know that was going to happen in the game. I would have put a camera on. I was over the moon during that portion. It has molasses in it. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> this place is still full of boxes, but hey, I mean, they were fighting an alien invasion. I get it. Perfect excuse to not clean up. Thanks again for the donation, Peter. You're welcome. Oh, we actually did the donations for Aunt May and stuff. That's cool. Uh-oh, what's this? Dude, he's going to keep it going. That's awesome. It's a full-time job, though, dude. Saving the world. Whoa. He didn't answer the phone. Have you talked to Miles about it? Not yet. <laughs> you ready? Uh, Miles. I, I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about some. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you all, all the time. It's 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 great. He's uh, he's quitting. Talk. So many good talks. Uh, I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you, about. Pete. Uh, wait, I get uh, it, dude. Let me start again. I got this. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. There you go. Are you? Are you sure it's? It's a big city. Yeah, and you I did can. it too. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. <laughs> Dude, I would be too. I mean, how many people Maybe has Peter now, lost in this universe? Come a time. In every I'm universe. You. Always. And he'll be back. I mean, you can't do a goblin story without Peter Parker. So we're going to need his help. He's just going to go be Peter for a while. And, dude, he's earned it. Big time earned it.
these characters never get happy endings. Not even brief happy endings sometimes in the comics. So I'm all for this. It's the same reason I like the ending of The Dark Knight Rises. And you see Bruce Wayne go off and have a life. Like, they earned it. Holy cow, like ten times over they've earned it. What do you want? The Spider-Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son. loss even you Norman what are you writing the final chapter oh another scene sweet Is that Uncle Aaron? Oh, it's her date. Oh, it's his date. Oh, okay. Because she still hasn't met. He... Wait, did she say she had? Did his mom say she had a date hey, earlier? Hi. Oh, she... introducing. Oh, that's you're awesome. Hungry. <laughs> Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He works oh, so you finally today. finished it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Miles. <laughs> He's just like, uh, just, just, my mom's weird. <laughs> it's a cool room, man. A lot like Peter Parker's. Some guy in Harlem. Probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. All right. I like the version of that person. Oh, sh she's cute, man. She's a cool addition to the to the universe. Look at that. Just has it in there now, just hanging out. It's got the scarf. Is it Christmas? Or Thanksgiving maybe? It's cold out. Oh, that's a scarf she gave him. To keep him warm. That's right, from his game. That's right, I remember that. That was a really cute scene, actually. Dude, kiss the girl, man. <laughs> Miles. Oh. <laughs> oh, it is her date. Okay. So we're going to finally see who she's dating. I was wondering earlier, because they set that up, and I'm like, it's going to be someone from the Spider-Man universe. Hi. Miles Wait. Haley, this is Albert. Uh, hi. Nice to meet you. Albert. Hello, oh, Albert. And, uh, this is my daughter, Cindy. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Cindy, that's uh, what's her name? The the Spider Girl, right? Isn't there a Cindy Spider Girl? 
You have finished the main story, but both Peter and Miles are still available to continue their adventure. You can now start a fresh adventure with ultimate difficulty. Yeah, because I barely made it through standard difficulty. Silk, that's it. Silk, Cindy Moon. I was sitting there. I was like, isn't her last name Moon? But I didn't want to commit to it. Cindy Moon Silk. You're right. You are right. What's um, Oh. Hey, just wanted to let you know you got a package here at the house. Okay. A I package? I in the garage for you. It's from Norman Osborne. Oh, interesting. Oh. Thanks for letting me know. Really? Norman? Break time's up. Oh, so what did they talk about? Him and... Oh, because Ock... Doc Ock knows that Peter's Spider-Man. Does Norman now know that? All right, well, let's go find out what it is. Yep, coming in hot. Uh, whoops. Okay. It has one of those plants on it, so it's one of those EMF missions, right? It's the last one. The Emily May Foundation mission, that's right. Okay. What's this? What is this? Harry wanted it's you to have this. Drive? They say you should never plug in a drive of unknown origin. That's true. I'm no Norman, I think. Okay. See what the fuss is about. Peter! I put this together for you because I knew when we got through this crazy time, <laughs> whenever we got through it, I wanted you to have these. And have what? I wasn't positive I'd be here to give them to you myself. Wow. Harry. After the Emily May Foundation was destroyed by Craven's hunters. Yeah. I went to see what I could recover before it got boarded up. In the box, Oops. you'll find a piece of bark from my mom's tree. Oh. Of maize blossoms. And Dude. I if you gene splice them together, you might get a hardy enough plant to produce seeds. There you go. Well, okay. Let's do it. Okay. Um. Boom. Hey, we did it! Finally! Let's <laughs> splice it together. Now, you know Kaiser said he got stuck on us for a while, too. Yeah, that was a little tricky. We just leveraged their relocation data sets to plant those seeds around the city. You're some kind of genius, Harry Osborne. All right. Let's get those bees working. I know, I know. It'll be years before we see the results. That's okay. The next game's going to take place a few years from now, so. Which is why I did this simulation to show you. So Emily and May will live on in the city and Look at that. In us. Heal the world, right? I love you, Pete. I really do. And I know the foundation didn't end up going the way I'd hoped, but there's still no one I'd rather try to win. We're going to keep it going, man. Started a new foundation. Just me and you. Scratch. Future foundation. Go us. <laughs> Go us. We got this, man. One last thing. What? I got a little something for you. What's this? Good help. Okay. Whoa. Hey, astronaut Spider Man. What is this? Foundational. Dude, look at us. Life story. Oh, cool. That's cool.